Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. So in today's session, we'll discuss about uh, one more concept in uh, DBMS that is what is data? What is a database? What is a DBMS? What is a SQL? So all these are related to our uh, database management system. So we'll discuss uh, what is what. So first coming to the data. So a data is an information which is unprocessed data, right? It's an unprocessed data. Unprocessed data. Right? So there is no structure for the particular data. So only the data which is uh, saved in an electronic mode. And coming to the database, this data is organized here. Organized data. Right? So, the storage of organized data is known as a database. So, here we will be having a different models. So, based upon the model, the data will be organized. For example, so coming to the RDBMS. So, that means a relational database model. Okay. Relational database model. So, in this RDBMS, the data is stored in terms of rows and columns rows and columns simply we can say them as a tables the data will be stored in the form of tables so one database can have a multiple tables right so whatever the unprocessed data is available that data will be processed in an organ organized data that means it, it will be stored in a organized fashion right so that we call it as a database and database a database can have multiple tables multiple tables okay so that means data multiple data can be stored in terms of a tables and then the extension for this database is dot db so that means we can store all these tables in a single file called dot db so every file will be having the extension similarly the database files are also having the extension this dot db then what about this dbms now we had an unprocessed data and that unprocessed data is organized in a structured fashion which we call it as a db database and now if you want to access the data that means manage the data managing the data means addition that means adding some data or deleting some data or updating some data so all type of manipulations can be done with the help of this tool. So DBMS, DBMS is a tool which is used to manage the database. Manage the data means, means manipulations, doing the manipulations, the adding the data, inserting the data, right? Whatever the manipulations we can do that can be done with the help of this tool. DBMS is a software or a tool which is used to manage the data from the database and example for this dbms are like uh, oracle mysql sql server mangodb sql light so there are more number of tools available in the dbms right so in order to access the data from the dbms i oh, sorry database right to manage the database so this dbms is a software tool and database is a collection of organized data so in order to process this data that means in order to process the data we need to retrieve the data so if you want to add some data if you want to delete some data if you want to update some data so that can be done with the help of one language called a structured query language. So structured query language, so SQL, SQL is a structured query language 
which is used to manage the data in a database. That means if you want to insert the data, that should be done with the help of one command that is a SQL. If you want to delete the data, that will also be done with the help of SQL. So we commonly call them as queries. So we have to write the queries and by means of queries only we can manipulate the data from the database. So here the term manipulation means both additions or deletions or updations, whatever it may be, retrieval. So whenever it is required, so we can retrieve the data from the database. For everything, we have to write the queries. So this queries, we call it as structured query language. So with the help of structured query language, so the data, data from the database will be retrieved by using this DBMS tool. So even though there are a lot of DBMS tools, so in all the cases, in the backend, it will generate a query and by executing the query, the data will be accessed from the database. So without the query, the data cannot be accessed from the database. So DBMS will be using this SQL commands to access the data from the database. So this is the major difference between the data, database, DBMS and SQL. Hope you understood. So data is an unprocessed data and if the unprocessed data is organized in a structured manner that we call it as a database and accessing the managing this database is called the is done with the help of a tool called dbms and the data is accessed from the database with the help of sql structured query language right so hope you understood this one so if you are having any doubts regarding this one, feel free to post your doubts in the comment section. Definitely I will try to clarify all your doubts. If you really enjoyed my session, like my session, share my session with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Thank you very much.